Blair Witch Trial. Welcome. Just playing. I don't play like that. I don't play with ghosts and stuff. Hey, y'all. <laughs> Welcome. Wrinkle shirt and all. I'm here. I'm here, girl. It's dark in here. Believe it or not, my window is up, but we are expecting severe thunderstorms, according to the local weatherman that I follow. So uh, that natural light is not hitting. Shouts out to Coach Lee, <laughs> my Facebook manager today. <laughs> Thank you, girl. <laughs> this time change got me all off. I done took a nap and everything. Thought I had a whole hour before I had to go live. And here I is, y'all. Here I is. So, I'm going to try to play with this light. Oh, that look better. How are you guys? Say hello when you come in. Let me know you hear you watching. I'm trying to get me some light so y'all can see me. But apparently I ain't doing it right. I'm Dr. AJ Austin. If you're new here, welcome. I have a lot of new Facebook friends. I appreciate you guys. You're in the right place if you want to become a black woman certified life coach. Hey, Asia, or is it AJ Taylor? Sandra Rodriguez, Tracy Starseed. Hey, the light is good. I'm sitting here looking at the thing in my eyes. Thank you, girl. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to see me. Y'all see me. Um, but you know, these little ring lights and stuff. So we playing around who here is trying to become a coach. Cause I'm going to tell you guys what's coming up next. We have officially slash unofficially <laughs> sold out of this weekend's, um, upcoming virtual future black life coach boot camp. Let me tell you why. So if you're new here again, I'm Dr. AJ Austin. I feel like I'm screaming at the top of my lungs. I think I'm just excited. And I had a nap. Y'all know that nap, nap energy hit different like that after church nap. Anyway, I train black women of faith to become certified life coaches online in one day, right? And as a part of that, I educate you guys on what it means to become a life coach. So who's here trying to become a life coach? Because um, the boot camp this weekend is the step in between you gathering research. You know how y'all do Google University, YouTube University, Stalker University on people's Facebook lives and such. Um, collecting information, trying to make a decision, but you don't know where to start. That was a whole lot of air quote, wasn't it? This weekend's boot camp is going to tell you where to start, answer your questions, and help you know what your next step should be with becoming a black woman certified life coach. Even tips on how to find your perfect life coach certification training. Hey, Tanessa, how you guys? Tracy says me. Tracy, I'm hot, girl. I'm only 40. I shouldn't be having hot flashes. I think it's because I was rushing to get on camera. So y'all bear with me. I hope you can hear me outside of the wind blowing into the phone. Anyway, y'all. So technically, I got a lot of little bunny ears going on today. Um, we have sold out of the spots. I made space for 12. I actually think we're over 12. But here's why we're unofficially officially sold out. Um, but if you want to come. I might make room for you real quick. I wanted to keep the group small because I want to answer all of your questions. I want to hear your vision about becoming a coach. Um, like Tracy said, I was hesitant. I'm Muslim and didn't know the extent of the religious content. Yes. Yeah, so I'm Christian. I believe in Jesus. One of my best, closest people in my life. She was my college roommate. She is Muslim as well. We got the same birthday. So we just as crazy. I don't know. I don't think religion has anything to do with it. She used to read my Bible in the dorm room. That is my home girl. Anyway, I share that because I just love my Muslim friends. So, <laughs> but yes, I am Christian. I believe in Jesus. I quote the Bible. I quote scripture. The women that I train are Christian. We do pray. Um, and that is who we are, you know. And so we have women from all over the world, 150 black life coaches all over the world. And so one lady who joined us just before my nap <laughs> today um, she has registered to be there, but she will be there in spirit. So she is waiting on the replay of the event, which means that a actual virtual spot is open. Someone can come and join in her spot, but, you know, still register and get the goods, but you get her spot because she won't physically be there. So it's not like you and her are going to be there. You're actually there in her stead and she's okay with that. So. I wanted to jump on here and tell the person who is trying to swipe up that spot because somebody snuck in there too. <laughs> I am opening up that one spot. If you head over to um, Black Life Coach Bootcamp, I think that's the right link. Black Life Coach Bootcamp, check it out. Let me know if it works for you. If not, I'll, I'll send you or tell you the right link. Get the sleep out of my eyes, y'all. <laughs> 
Um, what questions do you have about becoming a coach, Tracy? Uh, because one of the things we're talking about in the boot camp is how you can use your personality to be the best coach. I came up with a very new um, assessment with just that. This whole year, sorry, y'all, bedhead. We're good. Um, I have been working with, I have three coaches now. I'm wrapping up my work with one who is trying to extend for another year. And I'm like, hold on, my brain is just, whoo. So anyway, um, one of the coaches that I'm working with is about, you know, just being who you are and what you do as a coach, everything from your marketing to the clients that you serve and how you show up online and offline and what people can expect from you. Just like how I went down a list of I'm Christian, I'm saved, I love Jesus, so are my people. You want to be that type of coach as well because there's someone who is waiting for you to show up. Hey, Coach Corretta Yadexi, she is coach 123 out of the 150. My coaches show up, they represent. Shouts out to Coach Lee. Coach Lee, I don't know your number by heart, but she got me all the way right. She was in my inbox like, um, Dr. AJ, you going live at seven, right? I was like, no, girl, it's eight. She said, well, your email today said seven. I had to check the email. Show did. My assistant, which was me before the nap today, thought we had an extra hour. But this spring forward just got us just woo. So I slept. (laughs) Tracy says, I have a woman's organization that builds on the formation of goal setting. So learning how to manifest my mess into a message is my primary goal. Awesome. So that's a part of what we have coming up, Tracy. Um, And you may be interested in joining us or at least getting on the email list to see what's coming up because um, everything that I do is not specific to just black Christian women. It's specific to women. Hey, Coach Sonia Ashford. We're so glad that you are alive, girl. You've been quiet over there. I told Marquita yesterday to check on you. We're going to bum rush you in your inbox. Like, you okay? You all right? You good, girl? You know I got your address. Okay. Okay, now. Anyway, (laughs) hey girl, good to see you. So coming up, we have something called, well, no official name, but the premise of it is prophetic manifestations. And I don't know about every religion, but I know that most black women that I know believe in manifestation. They believe in like speaking things that are speaking things to life, speaking life into thing, calling those things out. I'm like mixing like all the quotes that I've heard in scripture and stuff that I've been taught. But I came up about a year ago, maybe someone begged me to put together a course because she said, Dr. AJ, I've been watching your journey. And we would, she and I would talk daily as business accountability partners. And she's like, just your level of faith, your tenacity, um, your work ethic, how you show up when you say things are going to happen, how they happen. Like you're the person that things happen to where people be like, dang, how she do that? She's like, please teach me your ways. She begged me and begged me. And I finally sat and put the information together. It's a whole course on how to speak those things. <laughs> and so um, another really good business accountability partner and I met yesterday at, uh, for coffee and she has agreed to come on board in partnership with me with what I'm calling, but she probably will help me come up with a cuter name, but we're calling it prophetic manifestations. It's about how to call things into your life, speaking existence, speaking things into existence. So yes, it's about setting goals, but it's also about putting in the work ethic and it doesn't have to be overwhelming. It's about, you know, where your faith level is and believing in things. Um, okay, so he says the job is in crazy. Girl, we miss you. Hey, Tuki, welcome. Hey, Claudia, welcome. We're talking about what comes up next after this weekend's boot camp where we have officially, unofficially sold out. We have one spot hanging in the balance where someone actually registered and claimed the spot, but she can't be there in person. So I'm going to let you, whoever wants this last spot over at blacklifecoachbootcamp.com, I'm going to let you come hang out with us live. Um, It's at least 10 of y'all. I'm thinking it's 12. I call myself up, waking up from my nap. Let me use the restroom real quick and I'm going to sit and list out everybody coming to the boot camp. And then my Facebook manager on today in my inbox, Coach Lee, it's like, um, you'll probably be on Facebook Live right now. So 
I do not have our final, final counts count. So I'm going to just go ahead and open up that spot for who wants to grab it on today. We've been sharing about this upcoming experience, which is a self-discovery journey in and of itself. But if you didn't get in for the boot camp, or if you're like Tracy, who was like, you know, I like you and I want to know what's coming up next, then prophetic manifestations may be for you. So I'll share our release date. That's going to be our April event, but I just wanted to you know, jump on and give you guys some what's coming up because a lot of you are in my LinkedIn inbox. You're in my emails and you're in my private Facebook messenger saying, Dr. AJ Austin, when is your next event? And so I have patted myself on the back. I've gotten better about sharing my event calendar versus just putting it out there on y'all so that you can plan what? Govern yourself accordingly. That's what I was trying to say. So this upcoming uh, manifestations course is all about from the black hand side I love saying that because you don't see a lot of black women talking about manifestation um and doing it in a way that's relatable one lady today didn't want to get off the phone with me she was like you're so relatable I'm like girl I'm just crazy and thank you and yes because y'all when you call me or when you email me or inbox me y'all be at work sending your cubicle one lady called me from the locker room at her job <laughs> one lady had to leave and go outside and sit in her car to talk so I know you guys are looking for relatability. You're looking to talk and share your dreams and goals about becoming a coach and, you know, um, maybe leaving your job and finally starting that entrepreneurial thing. These are y'all's words, what y'all tell me. And I just sit and laugh and chat with you on the phone. Right. So I share that because prophetic manifestations may be um, more your speed with. Yes, you have goals. But you also want to know what comes in between you setting the goal and you waiting for it to manifest. So this is like the remix to anything that you've heard about manifesting law of attraction or um, magnetization or whatever. I don't get into that. We definitely don't do crystals and tarot card readings and all that. Again, I don't get into that. That's not a part of my beliefs or religion or who I am. But we're introducing the business aspect of how to make your dreams a reality, whether it's becoming a coach or getting certified or leaving your job or starting a business or finally walking into your experience of sharing your story and your expertise with people who you know need it, whether you do it on the side or do it full time, you're really believing that, yes, this is how I want to make my money next. We're going to talk about how to manifest things. For example, I did a virtual retreat for three days this weekend where I was the student. I literally paid and sat and because people know who I am online, they never just want me to sit, you know, in their class. They're like, so Dr. AJ, what's your opinion on? So I end up helping and teaching and training, just trying to learn. And um, one of my friends said, um, we know you're not there to learn. But if you could just impact one life while you're there and you never know who may see you that needs you. And I was like, OK, use my words back on me. Thank you, girl. So that kept me motivated before the class and all throughout because it was three days. That's 24 straight hours. And she wanted our cameras on looking at her. And y'all know how busy I am. <laughs> so my camera was off most of the time. But I'm still listening and alert and talking and um, interacting. And right as the event was wrapping up on yesterday, I got a message that said, hey, I saw you were a part of this group, which was a part of the, the retreat. Where can I sign up for your boot camp? And I was like, my friend said, if I just impacted one life, this would all be worth it. Now, the boot camp was definitely worth it. I learned a lot of unexpected things that I was that I was um not expecting to learn. And I did that by just watching, observing, observing, taking notes. But that one person turned into another person. Hey, I see you got a boot camp coming up. Tell me where's the link. I'm ready to sign. So the last two people, including the one who's not making it on this weekend, that you could take her spot over at blacklifecoachbootcamp.com. Three people, y'all, were manifested. All because I set a goal. I said, okay, God, this is what I want out of it. My friend touched and agreed with me. You guys know we believe in touching and agreeing and um, speaking things to life. And she said, if you just impact one life, you never know. Now, you, y'all know I say that every time I'm on here live with you, right? And that one turned into three. And the fact that we were at coffee while this was happening. And I was like, girl, you said if only one person came from this. And I wasn't even on there like selling hard and trying to get people to. I wasn't doing that. I was chilling and I was being myself. 
And I said, okay, manifestation. (laughs) So she and I high-fiving in the coffee shop. And she saw me literally make money in that moment because of what we talked about, the goals we set and the actions that we took. It's a method to the madness and you have to be able to kind of set it and forget it, if you will. And so we're going to walk through it because she and I have been planning to teach something together and we both agreed on the manifestation because we're witnessing things manifest in each other's life. That's a small example right there. Very small example. So we're going to dive into more um, with the prophetic manifestation. So if you guys want the link to sign up to join us, let me know. Put it in the comments. I'll share it. I'm going to do some future lives on it, um, but I wanted to tell you guys what was coming up because some of you guys missed out on the opportunity to join us for this weekend's upcoming Future Black Life Coach Bootcamp. And you may want to get in. My events for black women, um, whether you're a coach or you're trying to become a coach or you're um, in between, like maybe you, you know, got certified, but you're not doing anything with it. Or maybe you're somebody who's been thinking about becoming a coach like Coach Lee said, I've been trying to do this since 1996. Maybe you are someone who wants to grow a coaching company as part of your retirement plan, like several of our coaches are, or you just want to have another stream of income. I met a lawyer this weekend who she lawyers full time. She's a full time attorney, but she's also a coach. I thought that was awesome. She helps other attorneys get um, through the bar exam. And so if you're in any of those categories, you may want to consider joining us for this upcoming event because my events are very popular. They sell out fast and I usually try to keep them small enough so that I can quote unquote control the crowd which really means just talk to you spend more time with you you know asking you questions letting you ask me questions and you getting those questions answered and everyone else gets um, blessed as a result of watching you get coached so I shared all that because it's two exciting things that are coming up whether it is you grabbing that last seat over at blacklifecoachbootcamp.com or you saying, send me the link for prophetic manifestations, Dr. AJ. I'm going to do that. I don't know if that'll be our final name for the course. It's the name that I wrote down a year ago to do this course. Um, so I may come on and, you know, change it later. But just know that I'm talking about the same course. It's about manifestation. And it's on a really cute level <laughs> that I believe everybody can jump in and comprehend and implement in their lives. So are there any questions? about anything that I've shared, about what's going on, about what's coming up, about anything. Just go ahead and ask. I'll chill out and hang out with you guys for a few more moments. Coaches, if you're here, say hello. Let me know you're in the room. I know we got a lot of new new coaches, number one, that have recently become certified with me at the International Center for Life Coach Training. I got on my shirt today. It's super wrinkled. This is actually one of the coaches' shirts. I had two made on accident, so I just kept the other one. It's really comfy. I did laundry, so it's super wrinkled. But anyway, Black Life Coach Boot Camp is what I was typing in here. Black Life Coach Boot Camp. Grab that last seat if you think is yours. Whoever, first come, first serve, y'all. I ain't holding nothing. One lady called and she was like, I'll sign up at, at lunchtime. Her lunch came and went and two people grabbed her spot. So I think that is it. Let me scroll. I'm pinning in the comments, blacklifecoachbootcamp.com. Somebody grab it. And let me know if you want to join us um, because I'm supposed to be sending out the agenda right now. I got it written out. I just need to type it up. Um, But the site describes exactly what we'll be talking about in the class this weekend. I get to spend two days with you guys, 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. Eastern. And I will be on time. I'll be caught up on sleep by Saturday. (laughs) <laughs> so we'll have a good time. Are there any questions for me? I know y'all are hanging out with me. I appreciate it. Shouts out to all of you who are new to this life coaching journey. And thank you for trusting me to be a part of that journey with you as you grow and collect your information and make a decision, et cetera, et cetera. Thank you guys. Any questions? My main light went out. It's right above me, and it's not the bulb, it's the switch. That's why it's so dark in here. And it is, um, (laughs) it is, uh, loading up to storm out here in these Georgia streets. So it's a little dark. Any questions before I go? Where y'all at? 
Y'all stay out here. I see some numbers on that man. Mm-hmm. Let my cough drop. Any questions, coaches? Future black life coaches? Any questions? Okay, I know what I'll do next. All right, so I'm going to wrap this up. I don't see any questions. If you want the link for Prophetic Manifestations, let me know. If you want the last spot for Black Life Coach Bootcamp, because our future Black Life Coach won't be there in person, head over to blacklifecoachbootcamp.com. And until we meet again, my friends, remember there's someone somewhere. They're waiting on you to walk in your destiny so they can walk into theirs. It's because when you let your own light shine, as you can see, you give others permission to do the same. As a future black life coach, when you impact one life, you impact generations. Walk in your destiny so others can walk into theirs, okay? It's time. Let's do this. Meet me over at blacklifecoachbootcamp.com or inbox me for the link for Prophetic Manifestation. And I'll see y'all soon. Have a phenomenal rest of your night. Plezzy, call me for the tea. I'll tell you what happened to the light girl. Bye, y'all. <laughs>